first alert weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. Get ready for some very nice weather as we end the week and we look at the week ahead. We're looking for spring like temps out there. Rain chances over the next seven days are very few and far between, although could see a few showers on your St. Patty's Day, even a rumble of thunder. We'll talk more about that coming up in just a little bit, but spring will start officially in six days. And even with the start of spring, we're talking 70s and 80s and near record highs. Average highs for this time of the year are in the mid to upper 60s. Forecast high today in Myrtle Beach, 75. The record 76, so knocking on the door of that record along the Grand Strand. Record high in Florence, though, 85. We'll stay three degrees shy of that with a forecast high of 82. But all in all, still talking unseasonably warm weather to stick around for the next three days. High pressure and control off the southeast will continue to supply that warmth across the area and keep us mainly dry. We are going to watch for a sea breeze to develop that will bring in some extra clouds each and every midday and afternoon. That'll continue to push inland. Our next chance for rain will come in as we approach the weekend Friday to Saturday and a cold front approaching the area could entice a few showers or even a rumble of thunder as it passes us by. It won't bring in a huge change to our temperatures, although a little drop in the numbers is expected on the backside of it for Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. But we're still talking unseasonably warm weather with the 70s sticking around area wide. Now your Grand Strand seven day forecast. Looks like, well, for the next three days, very similar to today. Mostly sunny, nice and seasonably warm. Down by the beaches, highs around 75. That'll be where Myrtle's Inlet, Surfside, and Myrtle Beach top out today. 74 in North Myrtle, 79 in Sockesty, 80 in Carolina Forest and Lawrence, even 81 in Conway. We'll look for a high of 81 also in Marion, Laurenburg, and Rockingham, up to 82 in Darlington, Lake City, Florence, and Johnsonville. Very similar conditions out there for your day tomorrow from start to finish. Still holding those mid-70s. Through the start of your weekend, more clouds out there late Friday and into Saturday as that cold front approaches and a few isolated thunderstorms certainly not being ruled out. After that cold front passes, though, look for temps to top out in the low 70s still Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. Still looking for partly sunny skies. Wake up temps mid to upper 50s. Inland areas looking for highs to stay in the 80s, low to mid 80s Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and even 80 degrees on Saturday for your St. Patty's Day. Keeping an eye on that Saturday forecast for that slight chance of a few showers or thunderstorms as well. Could even see one or two out there on Friday, but we'll keep you posted as the week progresses. After that front moves through mid to upper 70s, Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. So all in all, some great looking weather's coming your way. Certainly pleasant weather to be out and about and enjoying. Just be aware if you are heading down to the beach and if you're going to enjoy that nice uh, spring like warmth down at the beach as a little cool ocean breeze will develop. Water temps only in the upper 50s and that breeze off the ocean will certainly make it feel noticeably chillier at the beach. So be prepared for that. Otherwise, have a great Wednesday. Your latest news and weather updates are always found on your website, carolinalive.com.